Hello everybody, welcome back to another Adobe Premiere Pro 2022 tutorial. This one, I'm going to show you scene edge detection and how you can take any footage, your own footage or another person's footage or maybe a movie or a music video and figure out where all the scene changes are and where all the endings and the cuts are. What am I talking about? Well, let me show you. I've got this quick three minute intro to Pirates of the Caribbean, right? And if you flip through it, there's lots and lots and lots and lots of uh, scene changes just like that. Well, how do you detect them without having access to the original footage? Easy. Right click on it and then go down a little bit and you're going to see it right here. Scene edit detection. So what we're going to do is I'm going to apply a cut at each detected cut point. So everywhere there's a cut, I'm going to apply a cut to match the original footage. I'm going to create a bin of subclips. So if you're uh, if you're an editor or maybe you're a color corrector or you're looking to add effects, it'll create a bin of each of the clips so you can work on each of them. And I'll also create a marker as well. Why not? Okay, so let's left click on analyze. Let's see what happens. I'll speed this up. All right, it's just doing a quick analysis. Beauty. It shouldn't take too long because we're only doing three minutes of footage, but it is kind of uh, resource intensive, if you know what I mean. So here we go. And then there'll be about 50 something separate cuts or edits uh, in the original footage, I believe. I can't remember the exact number, 50, 52 cuts. And now look at this, look here. Every single time that a screen and edit changes, watch. Click, that's one. This will be one right here, watch. New. It's done a fantastic job. It's detected all of the scene changes, all the cuts and edits. And now if you go into this little bin here, if I wanted to color correct any one of these particular pieces, like this one, for example, I could just double click it or I could just select it on my timeline, pardon me, and just add the effect right there to it and then keep that apart from everything else. So that's scene edit detection, guys. Thanks for watching. Ton more stuff coming up. Stay tuned.